Jake, Jacob's thrown up again. I don't know what to do. He seems to be getting really worse. Seems that we've tried everything. I, I'm not sure what more we could do. Uh, I think we should just give him another Tylenol. Okay, let's let's go. Take the title off. Oh my god, Matthew! Thank god you're here. He had a heart attack, I think. Oh no. What? What is it? I think I left my oven on at home. But is he okay? Oh, for sure no, he's dead. Oh no. I don't know. I just found Matthew dead on the floor. The paramedics came. They pronounced him dead. I need you, Blueberry. I need you, Cinnamon Pot. I have a really bad headache. I think I'm gonna take some... Tylenol. He started off with just a simple headache. We gave him a Tylenol, then he started vomiting. So we gave him another Tylenol, and he collapsed, and he he had died. Uh, do you know Do you know any reason why he might have died? So our team carried out examinations on the body, and we found traces of cyanide. So it means the death was a result of cyanide poisoning. What this does, it acts as an irreversible enzyme inhibitor and it basically prevents the cytochrome C oxidase from transporting electrons to the oxygen in the electron transport chain of, of um, aerobic cellular respiration. So are you saying that he essentially died because of the Tylenol? Yes. <laughs> Man, what a rigorous workout. Tylenol. I don't know, Fabiana. I'm gonna work out a little bit. It's time for school, Fabiana. 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 Oh, God, I didn't call 911. Paramedics? Paramedics. My son is not breathing, and he is not responsive to anything. Oh, my Lord! Oh, God, no. What? He's massive. He must bench so much. Is he alive? Look at his arms. Jeez. I don't care about his arms. Is he alive? I bet he drinks more wa creatine than water. It's Jeez. insane. Are you guys even... Is he alive? No, he's for sure dead, but Definitely it doesn't not. matter. Wow, but look at that. He's dead? Yeah, but he's a self more than poor than me. <laughs> Fabiano's father met with a toxicology specialist later that day, Fernando Bautista. Dr. Bautista explained to Fabiano's father that the toxicology department had recently developed a cyanide antidote kit containing sodium thiosulfate. When this kit is given to the patient immediately, it is able to reverse and counteract the effects of the cyanide.